and you've got like a long black coat, single breasting, and you walk in and you've got the black coat and you've got like that lace showing and then they see that red flash, it's the only colour you've got is that red trouser. Anyway. Hi guys, welcome back. First off, I just want to say thank you for everybody's love on last Friday's video, the one just before this, on my favorite vintage shops. I said it's my gift to you, and honestly, your gift to me was just the reactions to it. So I'm really, really happy that you liked that movie, because that's how long it was. Anyway, I'll link it below for anyone who hasn't seen it. But today, I wanted to talk about holiday dressing, Christmas party clothes, the kind of stuff where, you know, you're starting to have talks in the office about the office party, where is it gonna be, what are you going to wear, any other kind of friends, family, you know, just party season is literally from now onwards, right through till New Year's. So I thought, let me just start now and give you my favorite recommendations for the type of holiday or party clothes that I personally would wear. And this also the kind of thing that, because I don't like to waste my money, I want it to last beyond just that night. I want to be able to, whatever I buy for a party, it needs to be, it just needs to be practical enough to know that I can translate it and to wear it going beyond that. So this is for you. It's not the usual stuff that has you dressing up like a flipping Christmas tree. Okay, so what am I gonna start with first? Oh, the first one I'm gonna start off with is actually the very last one that I came across when I was just about to hit record for this video. It's from Saks. They have a up to 60% off sale, which has just started. And they have something from, I think it's their Saks collection. And I saw this blouse. I love blouses like this. You know when they sort of tie here? But this oversized floppy bow on the side in this beautiful metallic gold. Now, metallics obviously I know are in over the holiday season, but I only want to show you ones that to me look kind of cool. I love this blouse. It's reduced from like, how much was it originally? I think it was $225 down to $135. Look at the cuffs, defined, that poet-like sleeve. This is the perfect cut blouse to wear with anything. And I do mean anything as far as like, you're going from office to party, this blouse is it. You put this underneath your blazer, take the blazer off, you're wearing a skirt or your trousers, just fling on the pair of heels. Velvet as well would look really lush and very like, just really sort of expensive with this. I think this is excellent. Goodbye, doesn't break the bank too, too much. And it's on sale, and I just love that it. it's an effortless kind of retro throwback, sort of Bianca Jagger type of shirt. I think this is a gorgeous blouse. Under suit, under a men's suit. Wear this under a men's suit. Gosh, oh, so good. Next up, what is up next? Okay, Marks, Marks and Spencer's, how much is this? Hold on. 112, I'll put everything on the screen obviously and link it below. $112, look at this velvet, is it velvet? It is, isn't it? Yeah, velvet floral, long sleeved midi dress. This is one of those dress unicorns that you just don't see often at a reasonable price point, at least ones that look stylish in my eyes. I saw this one from Marks and Spencer's. It is that fantastic winter floral, got that black base to it, so the florals go on top of it, and the floral print itself, the color is very autumnal, perfect for the season. Velvet, even better for the holiday season. To me, velvets are very multifunctional, because one, you can wear them because they keep you slightly warmer because it's a thicker fabric. Two, it's perfect because it looks so seasonally appropriate for any parties. This with a pair of heeled boots, heeled ankle boots, <gasps> heeled black ankle boots. No, heeled black sock boots. That would look so flipping chic. Now, like I said in the beginning, I am not one to recommend anything that is too, what's the word, just typical for the holiday parties. I want something, and I want you to wear something that's a little bit different. So you will walk in and you'll have your own spin, your own take that looks a bit more unique than what is the standard offerings out there. And I saw this from Top Man. Yes, Top Man. It is a tuxedo suit. Is it Top Man? Yeah, it is. Top Man tuxedo suit. I believe it is not, it's 
not cheap. I believe it's $400, but you're gonna get your way for this. You are not, and I'll be flipping upset if you do, you are not gonna wear this for that one night. You separate those out. Those pants will go with everything you've got at the moment, all your oversized jumpers, all your nets, white button down shirts, black button down shirt, a black button down shirt worn a bit sexy and you've got those like a slightly oversized like tuxedo pants that is a suit that you can wear to a Christmas party all by itself with a pair of heels so you've got the shirt and you've got those pants but for the purpose of this video I am showing you the entire look the suit I would buy the suit because like I just said it separates out doesn't it and you can wear like I just said the pants with a shirt or wear that blazer with anything that you've got or wear it together and I just think if you've got the guts for it and the double tape just wear it with nothing underneath if you've got those flat boobs you can just wear that jacket and all you've got is that deepness of your chest here if you're flat chested and you just put a bit of double sided tape so it sticks down love that stuff by the way if you've not heard of it I'll link it below it is your it is your best friend so let's use it all the time anyway wear that that whole suit, you walk into any party, I'm sorry, you're gonna look so flipping chic. Maybe just like a dark lipstick, dramatic. You could wear earrings if you want. Oh. <laughs> if anybody is gonna buy this suit or is going to wear a men's mannish style tuxedo suit for the holiday season, let me know on Instagram because I am itching to see what you do. Oh, I saw this dress. You're going to look at this and go, this is boring. It's a boring black wrap, long dress with long sleeves. I could not be more covered. Everybody else is going to be wearing like these short dresses with their legs out. Well, let me tell you, you don't have to have a short skirt and a short dress and have all your legs out. You put this on, okay, and then you team it. You know what I'd do with this? I would team it with a belt like this one on the screen. I found this from Topshop. This sort of diamante sort of statement belt you put that there so when you walk into a party all you've got is that you've got that silhouette of that classic dress which already looks flattering because it's that wrap style and then you've just cinched in your waist with this statement belt that is the only bling that you've got maybe you want to put earrings but to me i would just let the focus stay right here people drop pendant um, necklace heel or one of the ones like a lariat maybe disappearing and then, then you can just wear a pair of heels if you so choose. But I love the idea of just wearing a simple black dress like this, goes in, goes out, long sleeved, casual, right? But then you dress it up for night, transition it, just put that belt, the statement belt with it, and just, you're just gonna wow everyone in a really effortless way. And you're comfortable at the same time. All right, so trouser wise, I saw these from River Island. These are beautiful, that beautiful, rich red. These are high-waisted, culotte cut, such a big reminder of my and other stories, wide leg corduroy pants. And it's got that pull belt here, which is a little bit wide, goes up on the waist, flatters you. This is fantastic. You can dress this up or down as much as you like. You can wear this beyond that night out. That's why I really love this because, you know, oh, wait, this is how I'd wear this this i don't know which i think it's gonna be on this side this is how i'd wear these red pants look yes yeah see you you understand, you understand you understand me now black high victorian blouse style lace long sleeved blouse and then you put this you contrast that with this black sock boots I'll even, I'll put some on the screen here so you can show. I'm gonna complete the outfit for you. That was how I would rock this. And then you walk in and you've got like a long black coat, single breasted, and you walk in and you've got the black coat and you've got like that lace showing and then you see that red flash, it's the only color you've got is that red trouser. Anyway. Next up, H&M. Oh, good old H&M. I always throw H&M in, don't I? I saw this blouse. To me, this is the alternative to wearing like a sequined, loud 
statement blouse. I sort of want it myself. Anyway, this to me is the perfect sort of transitional piece. I like that it's high neck. I love the sleeves of it. It's full. This is kind of like a very flattering cut because it's loose. Again, I would try, if you can, if it's available, go up a size or two in this because I think the beauty of a blouse like this is that it's a little bit oversized so it's got that drape. But this with a midi skirt and any one of those like sort of slightly block heeled or a slim heeled boot and then you just wear this oh, or even a wide leg pant and you walk into a party with this. This is just stunning. Okay, what next? Oh yes, two satin skirts, both from Nordstrom. They come in $114. Actually, no. One is, they're different prices. One is 99 and one is 114. One is gray, I'll put it on the screen here, and the other one is black. Now this, you just pick, choose your poison and which you think you prefer as far as your wardrobe is concerned, but to me, either works because gray and blacks are neutral. To me, during the holiday season, there's certain fabrics that come to mind as far as what you can choose from, at least in my books. Satin, leather, velvet, lace. These are the kind of fabrics that I think of when I'm thinking, when my mind goes towards the holiday season. So I would highly recommend either of these. And I particularly love, again, the length of it. It's my favorite. I just love midi lengths. I think they're so flattering, especially when you can contrast them with a heeled shoe, just to give yourself a little bit of a lift. Very subtle way to look sexy without even trying, because it just screams so much more chic and contemporary. Look at this from Mango. I saw this crossover sweater. How much is it? $69.99. How, look at this. This is beautiful. Like the idea of wearing it with like a leather or a faux leather pair of pants or with a pair of de denim jeans if your office or your party is like casual enough. I love the look personally of wearing like denim to a party and just wearing it like with a really like cool top. This to me defines that because it's effortless, it's simple, it's classic. You can wear this later on under any of your outerwear. You can also even wear like a skinny, layer this, this top, layer it underneath like a skinny polar neck, like a black polar neck. Then you put this deep V um, sweater on from Mango. That is such a cool look, oh God. Please tell me you're gonna try a couple of these looks. Another way that I would rock this sweater is reversed. I would wear it back to front, so the neckline is switched, so this becomes the high point up here, and then the deep V is at the back. I love that, I think that looks so, so that's so surprising and it's unexpected still, especially in something like this, because somebody thinks you're sort of more conservative, like it's like talking to you, having a drink, like, oh, it's hot, I know, the season is here, isn't it? blah, 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 whatever else you can waffle about on, on about, I don't know. But anyway, so you're wearing that and you say, okay, but I just got, oh, I just saw my friend over there. I'll be right back. And then you disappear. And they see the back and they go, oh, nice. You know what I mean? It's unexpected. This is, this is the <gasps> Okay, what next? Oh yes, and then sticking with Mango, I saw two pairs of uh, velvet pants and I'm gonna insert them here. I saw this first one, which comes in at $50, these palazzo trousers, so a bit more wide leg. And I thought these are great. Again, it's velvet, so you can wear this with anything you've got existing at the moment, just to add a bit of that sumptuous like holiday party material in. And then I saw another one, which I've also got on this site, and I'll insert a picture of it here. This looks like it's an absolutely full length one. It kind of reminds me of my blazer, like the color of it from the mango, the velvet blazer I was telling you about. Anyway, it kind of looks like that, but I thought this is a gorgeous neutral color. And I even like how it's teamed here with like a black knit. But again, take a leaf out of that styling book. You could wear it with a black knit, but if it's gonna to be too hot where you're going, why don't you team it with that lace blouse I was telling you about, the black one. She got lace and velvet. Lace and velvet. How beautiful a combination is that to wear for a party? Look, God, talk about pat myself on my own back. I do that all the time, but I'm sorry, I just believe in what I say so much, so why not? Anyway, I think this is absolutely stunning. Also, you could just wear it with a black t-shirt. If you're the kind of person, like I said before, you're not into this like fussy dressing, but you feel like, oh God, I've got to make an effort. What do I wear? Put these pants on, put a t-shirt on, maybe just a plain t-shirt. Could just maybe like a simple drop necklace here. Put a blazer over it. I think that would look really, really simple. Oh, so good. Oh, and for accessories, I thought I'd throw in a couple of accessories, and I find that Mango does some really good earrings. One is a pair that I've mentioned before in what? A video like three months ago? Mango keeps bringing these particular earrings back, and they're still on their website. Some of you have already told me on Instagram that you bought these earrings, and you've shown me pictures, and I love them on you. Perfect size, statement, but still elegant. Also on the Mango site, I saw these red ones. 
beautiful statement these really do stand out and I think I love the way she's like tucked her hair behind and you know what to me what makes these earrings really modern is that you make that the statement piece it's that either or philosophy that I've talked about in other videos before in the past which is either or right so if you're wearing like a big earring like that red one then you go with no um, necklace here so that the focus goes straight up here and your makeup I take that into, into consideration wear like a very simple makeup makeup maybe just like a simple like liquid eyeliner cat eye look and you just got that with a simple mouth the focus is just oh it just looks so so good it just in you're enhancing the earring and vice versa such a good look oh and contrast that especially like with something mannish like wear like the mannish suit earlier tuxedo suit and then you wear these earrings oh you don't have to you could just wear like a jumper with it but oh god it's so pretty what else what else what else oh gosh yes how much are these 158 158 shop bop vega i think it is i'm looking at the monitor no varic varic wide leg pants and they're faux leather they look like leather because they're kind of dull but you rarely see especially faux leather because in leather they do them all the iterations faux leather with a wide crop leg and this is i thought this was perfect i mean if this isn't the perfect marriage to wear with like heeled ankle boots i don't know what is and then you could wear it with actually i'll probably wear it with this couldn't you see those faux leather pants with this with those ankle i know you can visualize what i'm saying oh okay what else oh and sticking with anthropology look at this ruffled eyelet blouse in black to me this is just like a twist on a typical like black lace blouse you're wearing this with a little bit of ruffle i loved how pretty this looked again it's long sleeved so you can wear it as casual as it's shown here but you could also team it with any of those palazzo pants i was showing you earlier those leather cropped faux leather cropped pants oh be perfect with this I love stuff like this and this to me would look so good with like a beautiful strong lip whether it's a classic like red like a Russian red from Mac or like a really deep deep claret deep wine sort of lipstick like Mac cyber that would look amazing that is like a oh it's like a it's so dark it's like purple dark but when you like stain it a few times with a tissue it just comes out just see this beautiful gothic but beautiful princess like um berry look on your lips and it's stunning wear that with that blouse oh, that to me that's like a match made in heaven but so contemporary and last but not least sticking with the lace blouses i saw this one from shop Bop. this comes in at 69 dollars beautiful i think it's by who is it Birkin, I'm not sure who they are, but anyway, I saw this blouse. I thought this was fantastic. Again, ditto to the other two. I thought this is such a good piece to get. Again, the only reason I throw all these in is because they're perfect to wear around the year. So I reckon these are such good investments for you. Oh gosh, Top Shop, Top Shop, Top Shop. You lot are killing me, man. <laughs> look at this. Look at this dress. Yeah, I know. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's so beautiful, I think I even want it. It's a dress. And I know how I'd wear it. That's why, this is, this is my problem. I know how I'd wear these things, and it's kind of a problem. It is, right? It's good, but it's not. Anyway, this dress, $111, ruffle dress, beautiful. Look at the length of it. You could wear any kind of skinny belt with that. One of those ones that loops through, like a loop it, and it comes out like that or just goes the way around. Any kind of skinny belt would go with well with this. Such a good take on a, I don't know, a holiday dress or a party dress. This to me redefines that for you because I would wear this with a pair of strappy heels. <gasps> no, actually no, I could wear it like that, but ankle socks. I'd wear, I know, you're thinking how would I, do? I love, I'm sorry, I'm one of those girls that does like heeled shoes with ankle socks i'd wear it with ankle socks probably black yeah maybe black it depends on the shoe but probably black and then you just put like the, he the heeled um strappy shoe with it oh god that's gonna look so good oh and again this layered later on with a pair of like knee-high leather boots and you wear this dress it's gorgeous together 
Okay, what else? Marks and Sparks. Okay, back to Marks and Spencers. Anyway, they had this tuxedo blazer. Love the long line lapels on it. I thought this was so, so classic. It's gonna look so good with anything that you may already have that you're thinking about wearing for the holiday season. Let me see. Urban Outfitters has these sequin pants. If you're thinking like, you know what? No, I love sequins, because I love sequins too, but I prefer to wear them during the day. Um, this, these pants, these sequin pants from Urban Outfitters, I thought these were absolutely perfect. I love the cut of them, they're wide. Usually you see them as leggings, like, oh, sometimes leggings can make you do this, you know, like your hips are here and then it goes down like cone shapes, like for your legs, like, oh. But this to me looks so good. Team this with the tuxedo. Perfect together, I love it. Okay, so Urban Outfitters also has this Lurex looking similar to this material. Easy way of wearing something in the party season. It's not like your normal cotton white t-shirt. You bung this t-shirt on instead and you can just wear it like a simple skirt that you've got at work. And then you just put heels on, you're done. What's your uncle? Was there anything else? Oh yes, also Zara. Zara, but you know what? I would flip him, bypass all the women's. I would go straight to the men's section and check out their men's suits. They've been coming out with some incredible, like ugh, ornate rock and roll suits that I just, I saw them and went, oh God, this is exactly what I would wear. If I was to wear anything to a holiday party this year, it would be one of these suits. Just, just like I said, just pick your poison and just wear them with heels or wear them with trainers, depending on the kind of person you are, because we are not all creative equal. We do not all want to wear a pair of heels. We may want to wear just what we would normally wear, but just jazz it up a little bit, but stay unique to who you are. Never lose yourself when it comes to style, especially when it comes to like the Christmas time, the holiday time, holiday season, it's like everything's like, ah! going mad buy this buy that and what are you gonna wear for Christmas and blah 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 always stay true to who you are and I hope that some of these options make you feel like that or at least inspire you to feel that way anyway that is my lot as always I hope that you found this video a little bit helpful for some alternative ideas for what to wear during the party season if it did in any way please do give this video a thumbs up and what was I gonna say um no, I think that was it. I make videos, as you lot know, twice a week, Tuesday and Friday. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, then please do. Um, and I think that is my lot. Have a good week and I will see you guys on Friday. Bye. I call this pussy bow blau, pussy, pussy bow blau. Oh, Karen. But another way that I would probably rock this twat, uh, not twat, rock this twat. Bigger on the size, bigger on the bigger on the size. Oh god, this video is going to be full of bloopers. And loud statement blouse. What am I doing? Keep. Oh my hands! I swear I need to like tie them behind my back or just just keep them in my pocket. Size but floppy blouse. Blouse. It ties on the side with this oversized floppy bow. <laughs> yes, I said it. Oh, I lost my spot. Where was I? Where was I? Where was I? Uh... Like Knee-high leather boots and you wear this, you wear this dress. What the hell is that? Could just maybe like a simple drop necklace here or put a, um, or just put like a, a blank, a blanket. Yeah, put a blanket over it or put a, I'd wear this just to kick it up a bit. I'd wear it with heeled ankles, heeled ankle socks. That makes no sense.